seconds. Okay. Uh, I'll think about that. Game uses an autosave system. Do not close the game while the icon is displayed. Press any button to start. Okay, privacy, blah, blah, blah. I give you my firstborn, right. Um... <clears throat> okay, language. Yeah. Um, audio. Okay, how's the music, everyone? You definitely want a controller for this. Can you use um? Drew, can you use like a Logitech or whatever? Is this a? I'm really worried. Okay, let me let me. I'm gonna be frustrated if this does the thing where it's like because I don't have an I don't have an Xbox controller. I don't like Xbox controllers, so I'm gonna use my Logitech. But I really hope it works. Uh, you sent me a mouse and a keyboard. I'm still using that mouse, actually, as we speak. I think I, I think this mouse, did I get? Yeah. No, I'm still using the mouse and the wireless pad. Appreciatively. Boop, 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 boop. I have a Logitech controller. I have PlayStation 5 controllers, Switch controllers and all that. But I'm really hoping that it will just recognize my Logitech. Although this thing is this thing is old. So well, that's not a good sign. Oh, wait a minute. Yeah. Auto save. Nope. Drew, what kind of controller did you use? Ugh. Ugh, ugh, ugh. I hate having to work through controller issues. Like, can you use a, a PS... Use Xbox? Can you use a PS controller? A PlayStation controller? Well, hopefully keyboard is going to work in the short term because I don't... Particularly want an Xbox controller? You also use one? Damn it, I don't like Xbox controllers. Okay, a French nautical term for a receding tide. What if it's Jusant or Usant? Oh, I see. Okay. Gotcha, Drew. It's Jusant, is it?
It's Jusant. Yeah, Jusant. Okay. I'm surprised you played this, Shadowed. Okay, I'm gonna turn down the volume a little bit. I'm surprised you played this because I would have thought the whole heights thing, you know? I would assume. Triffid, yeah. Rabble rouses at Arvin French. Reminds me a bit of the last guardian in feel. Chapter one, Daymark. Oh wait, wait, no, no, no. We have to. Uh, we've got to invert as God intended. There we go. Eh, it could be a little more sensitive, I think. That's better, I think. Okay, to climb. All right. It's get over it with Bennett Foddy. Okay. Wait, what? Oh my god, okay. Oh my god, uh... Wow, uh, okay. I am holding it. Icon displays a robe's main carabiner. When full, it means the rope is wound in. When empty, the rope is attached to a wall. Okay. Ugh. I really... I guess I'm going to have to just deal with the Xbox controller thing at some point. I just... Okay. 
Carabiners automatically secure the climb and show you the right path to take. Woo! Alright, here we go. Okay, interesting. Okay. Wow. Interesting. All right. Uh, oh, yeah, should be great. Three small icons represent secondary pitons. If they're full, they're available to use. If they're empty, they're already attached to a wall. Topped up to present to prevent yourself from falling. Okay. going to be there's going to be a situation where I'm going to hit the wrong one and I'm going to drop an arm I can already see it Down or up. Why? I don't understand. I'm in trouble because I don't know what I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. Oh god. do that. Mm. 
No, 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 no. What are you doing? No, no. Ah. This is so weird. Oh my god. That's not at all what I was doing. No. No, stop. I'm trying to go along. Mm. big trouble. I don't... Why? What the frick? Why? Why are you not... Wow. Oh, what the? F what? What? <laughs> what the frick was that? Wow. What? Why would it do that? Under what universe would that have worked? What? Oh my god. What on earth? I just don't understand what just happened. But like, what? Do, how do I? I th thought I'm supposed to use R to. Okay, I'm here. When on the ground, V Y's in the rope. That's what I was doing. Oh my goodness. My goodness gracious. Okay. Woo. That's what safety lines are for. Yeah. I, g I guess so. Yeah, we made it. This, this, like, holding on with one hand thing and, like, releasing the other hand is very weird. I kind of get it, but it, it's very strange. Uh. 
How do I... What is that control? Okay. <clears throat> yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Object interaction. Oh, not attributed. Oh, okay. Well, what, what, what the hell is that key? What is that key? Is that shift? Oh, it's shift. Okay. Another sleep turning over stones at the old delta. Harvest two belay stations for parts. A good catch. That should be enough to reopen the route to the old cape. Otherwise, it's all smooth sailing. A couple of old lanterns I think it can revive. Folks used to throw this stuff away. Oh, and I finally caught an old knitting machine for Ennio who's been asking for one for cycles. Not in great shape, but we should be able to tinker with it. Still not sure how I'm going to haul it up to low tide, though. Note to stealth. Start doing business. Stop doing business with Rem. All he does is dismantle my discoveries and sell them for parts in the heights. He claims to be a repairman, but he's nothing but a foam salesman, that's what. Okay. You are already fairly high up there, actually. Okay. Uh... No, 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 no. Alright, that's not it, obviously. Okay. It's a little hairy, but we got there. Ooh, what do we have here? Uh, is that like a shortcut? down here, yeah. <sighs> interesting, interesting. Okay. Can I take those? No, I guess not.
Hmm. Okay, interesting. So that's what it once sounded like there, I gather. how far out this rope goes. <laughs> Yeek, how are things at the sawmill? Business has been slow at the restaurant. Almost no one came to the last music night, even though people are climbing down from all over. I know we don't play the shells anymore, but still. I was thinking that adding scaffolding to the side of the upside-down cliff might help steer passers-by this way. I miss seeing a packed patio. Can you take care of it? I check with low tide and everyone agrees. Rope goes pretty far, but not forever. It's very cool that like this whole society based on climbing up and down mountains. Hey Mo, listen these things happen. I hope one day you'll ask me to do something besides taking boats apart to make ladders. Like if I'm free for a romantic dinner for two. Anyway, all good for your scaffolding since the village approves. I don't have much wood to choose from after that new path to the plan I had to build. But I still have a week or two left, wreck or two left over. I'll get to it when the currents allow. I owe you one. Thanks. You're the best. By the way, do you ever run into old Sonia? I think she's rummaging around in your area right now. If you see her around, do you mind telling her I need a new hob for my oven? Mine's taking on water. In the meantime, set sail for the restaurant. I'm not sure how romantic it will be, but we can always share a half-cooked meal. Interesting. Oh, I see it. Maybe. Oh, I made it. All right, sounds good. See you soon, Critchwitch. Thanks for stopping by. Yeah, we're gonna play for about another 10 minutes or so. What? What? I, what the, what? Okay. Uh, I'm going to play for about another 10 minutes, and as I say, we're going to see what we can do to play a lot of this on Saturday. What the hell are these things? It's called Lingo and it's all about words. Why would I not want to uh, play it to completion, do you think? I got farther than you do. Well, but that's because, I mean, that's because your laptop had the issues, as you said, so. Right, basically. Yeah, this looks safe. 
Oh my god. Damn it. Controls are going to drive me up. Synonyms, antonyms, uh, anagrams, and more, huh? That's cool. Let's go down a little bit. Puzzle near the end. Oh, I see. Yeah, I probably, you're right, I probably would get lost. That's cool, though. That's cool. I, I will have to, uh, I will have to check that out. It's called Lingo. It's new? Or are you just, you happen to just discover it? Oh my goodness, what? I see. Oh my god, really? That's cool. Cool. There, there's a lot of like, when you first get there, you're just kind of like, okay, wait for it, wait for it. You know, like I'm thinking through as I'm playing, like, am I, do I have it right? You know, like, am I figuring this out correctly? Have I planned my steps out? Which, you know, speed climbers, when they do this stuff, supposedly it's, the climb itself is not the thing that takes the time. They spend all this time really really thinking through like whether or not uh they want to oh my god places to go they spend their time thinking through like um how the climb is going to work basically so where do i go do i go there it's the planning that takes the time Lynn's gone to the heights to ask to extend the site. With the boss gone, the wind's gone out of our sails when it comes to digging. It's not such a bad thing. Lifting boxes, crates, and barrels is my area of expertise. But shifting their old stones? At the slightest pitch and roll, everyone's knees start quaking. 
Anyway, I was just getting used to the idea of working with archaeologists, making myself useful again, and already the work's dried up. I doubt it'll start up again. I don't see how we can move forward. How about you? How are things in low tide? Is Dee Dee still refusing to go to school? My love, I'm so happy to hear from you. We miss you so much, Dee says. I'm homeschooling her and I'm very much out of my depth. Do you remember the names of all the regions of the tower? I don't even remember learning that. I gave Dee a homework assignment about the old altar to keep her busy for a while. She's supposed to copy the design. I ended up going with her. It had been ages since I'd last ventured behind the village. I'd forgotten how dark it is. But you know Dee, she's gutsy, and she's enjoying diving into the past just like you. Speaking of which, have your archaeologists finally found out how tides work? They've been digging for a while now, get it? Do you know when you'll be able to come back up here? Interesting. Oh good, I did go the right way. I went the right way. That's super cool. I don't know why it matters, but I went the right way. Okay. Like, there's so many places I look at, I'm like, could I climb there? Should I climb there? <laughs> Playing with a human cheat code. That's true. If you ever had any issues, just be like, Shadow, what's the answer? And Shadow would be like this. And you're like, oh yeah, okay, thanks. Whoa. Whoa. Thank you, by the way, to GOG.com for providing this copy of the game, incidentally. Thanks to my friends at GOG. Hey, Bianca, how are things down there? I hear your boss sailed off into the horizon. Good riddance. I never liked him anyway. Things here at the hut are pretty quiet. Not many people stop by these days. A seasonal job when there are no more seasons. I'm starting to get bored. You can tell because I've started scratching letters. Tell me something to distract me, won't you? Oh, Amy, I'm so glad to hear from you. Yeah, I'm about as useful as a buoy on dry land, but no surprises there. You've been gone for a while, so maybe you don't know, but everything here is closed. Except for old Ennio's shop. He's still raising his chocos. Bassa tried to convince him to leave with him. Remember Bassa, the little terror at the back of the classroom? They got caught in quite a gale. It was amazing. No one's dared try again since. Do you think they're going to keep you on if people stop coming by? You might be seeing more folks, though. I came across a classified ad. They're mounting an expedition to explore the crow's nest. I'd like that, but going off on an adventure with strangers? Ugh. Oh yeah, I heard about that. Heading for the clouds, huh? That sounds like quite something. I'd better stock the hold. I bet they'll, they'll come this way. You know what? You should join them. Come see me, too. You don't have any excuses since you're out of a job. Hehehe. <laughs> it would be a nice change from the few stray travelers that still come by. Hey, the other day, another climber got stuck at Weeping Rock Pass. I had to go fetch them, if only you could have seen them. Stupid enough to eat hay, as they say around here. Okay, it's settled. I'll be waiting for you. not go down there? Oh, okay. Guess I'm, I'm overthinking it. I can just go here. Yeah, I could have just done that. Hey, Bianca, you must have cast off for who knows where. I went back to the postal relay. Still no water, surprise, surprise. Sally and Faz are still sorting through everything by hand, and I've gotten roped into helping with deliveries. Me on Pebbleback? That's what I thought too, Shadow. Um, you can imagine what a sight that is. Even I'm laughing at myself. Still, why not, eh? It's a fresh start. And I quite like seeing the world as the mail comes in. Well, it would be nicer if this damn pebble would just change course when I ask it to. I'm telling you, it's stubborn, worse than old Yom. Honestly, though, what a nightmare. Anyway, I'm going to miss the tide at this rate. I left your mail by the door.
Wow. Every so often you like get a look at one of these things and you're like, oh, there's a lot. A little, little mouse thing. Stairs up there that I have to check, which I will in a minute. This is giving my, like, I'm getting serious, like, fear of missing out on the right path vibes. <laughs> like, there's a part of me that's just like, am I, wait, am I, what am I, if I go that way, am I missing the other thing? Like. At the end, you find out this is FF twist. Exactly. It's called the chokening. So many items that I'm like, do I pick this up? Is do I have to pick this up? What is that? Oh. Yeah, I see it. And that's blocked, so I have to do this. Nice. Logbook, 12 octaves after the Jusant. I know. <laughs> I know. I'm just like, it's one of these games that I'm like, would not do this in real life. Would not happen. I'm finally leaving. I'm so happy I couldn't sleep a wink. At the old harbor master's office, a note caught my eye. It sounded like poetry. Expedition to the clouds, seeking hope and water. Join us at 12 octaves, Baker and Arlo's farm, Highfield, to journey together. After spending so long marinating and trying to find meaning in life, it'll do me good to see the world, as Amy would say. Hopefully we'll be stopping by her hut. Just the thought of seeing her again is enough to tell me I'm making the right decision. With any luck, there'll be other adventurers leaving from low tide. I don't want to make my way to the meeting point with the rest of the expedition all by myself. The only time I ever left here was for the harvest festivals when I was just a small fry, so an expedition like this is no small matter. They want to set sail for the clouds. Sting and all the boats are down there. Oh no, my parents. I forgot about them. What am I going to tell them? Hey folks, I'm off on an adventure. See you around if and only if I make it back alive. Of course, Bianca dear, don't forget to bring snacks. Hmm. I'd better not say anything, and I should bring snacks. What else? What do people normally take on this type of trip? One thing's for sure. What's a journey without a logbook? I've got it covered. I plan to make like the expeditions that set off for the salt plain in search of springs. I'm going to scatter my journal entries along the way for anyone who might come after us. Starting with this message. Farewell, my lighthouse. You welcome me with wonder and have kept me company as I've pondered too much. You've always been there for me. I'm leaving you to the weave beaks who will watch over you from the sky. And to watch over this message, I'm leaving one of my creations. Adventure calls, Bianca. It's the creation, exactly. Okay, okay. Uh. Oh crap. I think, I think. Oh my god, I think. I think I broke it. <laughs> I broke it. Can't figure it out. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, let's try that again. That was... That was dreadful, and we're never going to talk about that again. <laughs> I 
I got confused because I thought I could climb up on this. But what, what is the point? Why? Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Okay. Okay, good, because I was... Whew. You broke it, you fix it. Okay. Well, the jumping mechanic is still kind of screwing me up too many times because I get there and I'm like, what the frick? There's got to be something to read in here, right? Okay, right. Good, good, good. <sighs> All right. It's a schmoo. This music. Wow, there's a lot going on here. Wow. Chapter 2, Migration. Okay, right, I'll, play, I, I'll play another 10 minutes. I'm actually really enjoying this. Despite the control setup being weird. Okay. It's 
So now our reward is we get to meet the shmoo. Oh yeah, zip line. Is that is that what we want to do though? I guess all we were doing was to get up here to do that, huh? By using tab, your companion will be able to see the next objective as well as certain collectibles. Okay, so we have to get up there. Uh... Ooh, wow. Okay. Cool. Haha, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I know. Took me a little longer to go through the... Uh, oops. Took me a little longer to go through the photos than I thought. But that was fun. I was... Enjoying sharing it with people. It really was a great trip. I don't know if it does anything for me, but it's pretty. What's the point of doing that? It was just so I could be like, hey, look, a, a pretty picture. Oh, okay. Up there, huh? Um, just would like to get to the next section here, not the next chapter, but the next section.
It's, it's an interesting mechanic, this idea of having stuff. Uh, an interesting mechanic of having this be something that... Um, like almost like a save point that you set up. Hey, what's up, Imaginary Exponent? Yeah, I was doing uh, some show and tell before, and then I was playing a little bit of Juicent, uh, and started really getting into it, and now I was like, wait, I'm going too late, so I have to stop, but... Um, I'm gonna play like another five minutes, but... I've been doing one of those, just one more turn, Mom! You know, type of things. How you doing, Imaginary Exponent? I hope it's been a quieter, uh, day. Still Thursday night for you, yeah. mistake. Whew. It is very satisfying, though, when you make a climb like that and it works. That is very satisfying. <laughs> Yeah, that's good. They're oh hot, yeah. So here these people were just living their lives, doing their thing. And then something happened to all of them. Ha ha ha. 
Oops. Hey, listen, you know, exactly, video game logic. Why would you send me over here? Exactly. No, so this, I guess this isn't right. Come on now. Oops, nope. Okay. Let's go. <sighs> Dang, people, that was that was legit right there. All right, sounds good. Sleep well, Drew. I'm going to I'm heading to bed myself. I got to stop. This is really fun though. Hey, hey, hey! Got us a big old area here. The place is probably not huge, but it sure looks huge. Like, there's all these areas that I'm like, do I go here?
Wow. Okay. That's cool. Right, let me get up there. Oh boy. Oh, AD to move in a ledge. The classic. Law book, 12 octaves and one prime after the juice hunt. Usually just getting the low tide from my old lighthouse is an expedition for me. It's hard to believe that this time the adventure was just getting started. At the meeting point, I found myself waiting with Met, a young woman from these parts. Good night, Trippet. Well, young. Younger than me, anyway. Her parents have already left, but like other people our age, she wanted to stay. That made, ripper, that made ripples with the older generation. Leaving the family nest is no easy thing. I don't know Met well, but we already have something in common. The widening gap between us and our parents. She seemed relieved to see me. For once, I was lost for words, smiling awkwardly and still red from the exertion of getting there with my pack all undone and my hair sticking up every which way, probably. Nice one, Bianca. Not socially awkward at all. But I was just as relieved as she was to know I wouldn't be setting sail alone. To my surprise, Old Soul joined us, too. I don't think we'd exchanged a single word before now. Will an old schooner like him be able to keep up? Ever since I was little, Soul's always been the old hermit who lives up on high. He used to scare me. He would come down to the port sometimes like a spider sledding down a silk thread. The other kids and I would have fun running away, screaming at the sight of him. Even now, my knees started quaking as I saw him lumbering towards me. We set off as a group of three since no one else came to join our crew. I soon realized I'd been worried for nothing. Soul leads the way, an odd finger with, figure with nimble feet who climbs the cliffs with amazing ease. Met follows behind, brimming with energy. Suddenly, I feel like the old one, Bianca. I see. Nice. Some good screenshot material, I think. Okay, elevator up. Okay. Well. So I got to get to where the next save point is, I think. Nope, 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 nope. Nope, nope, nope. Climb up, climb up. Save point, save point, save point. Save point, save point, save point. We'll assume it was the intended route. Yeah, I'm sure that was exactly how they drew it up. Oh, I see. Uh-uh. Okay, 
So that was a save point. That was a save point. Uh, let me just go to this area and hope that I can get back to where I came from. Interesting, this thing with these plants. <laughs> Outstanding. Okay. Safe point up here would be great. Any safe point up here would be amazing. These upside down grabs are just Okay, this is going to be perfect. This is going to be perfect because this is going to be a thing that picks up and that's going to save it and then we will stop. to go but I had a good time sharing things about the UK trip and then all of a sudden I'm like hey how about I play this game that turns out to be super interesting Nice. And there's the save. Yay! Okay. Oh, this is the gallery. Uh, let's see. So the first one I found was this. Each morning the waves carry in the day for as long as we remember we dance the dance of tides. And then in the night, the stars tell tales, the firelight warms us, we laugh, we dream of stories of days to come and days gone by. Everyone said that this was super chill and like... Chill with occasional moments of terror. <laughs> Alright. Very cool. All right, well, we have now put in an hour and 14 minutes into this, and this is not a super long game from what I understand, so we will see. We might be able to finish it um, next time. It's possible. Um, if not, then it might be one other session beyond that, but it won't be longer than those. So, so that was cool. I hope you folks find that interesting. Um, it's a nice little palate cleanser after Final Fantasy VII uh, Rebirth, which is, um, which was pretty freaking intense, as we all know. Um, so now that we're back with this, all right. So uh, anyway, um, and then you know, uh, also we have uh, unlimited adventures coming soon, as you know, for the subathon. So uh, I will see you, lovely folks, back here on Saturday. Um, I'm planning to start sometime between seven and eight, and we are gonna play that game. We're gonna do more of Juicent. We'll see if we finish it. Um, and then next up after that is going to be the Unlimited Adventures game, Curse of the Fire Dragon. Very excited for that. That's going to be super cool, both retro and new. It's going to be awesome. So 
I'm looking forward to that. But um, thank you all for joining me for this and for the UK trip. I hope you enjoyed a little bit of a walk down recent memory lane for me and you enjoyed uh, some of the pictures and videos. Um, and uh, yeah, it was fun sharing that with all of you. If you like what you saw and heard tonight, please follow the channel. Please check out the YouTube at exclamation point RFTube. Thanks to those of you who watched over on YouTube today. Discord is exclamation point RFCord. Please join us over there to hang out with the Arvonauts in between streams. Twitter is exclamation point RF tweets. Blue Sky exclamation point RF Sky. Website arvanelleron.com. Financially, exclamation point RF shop is the merchandise area. Exclamation point RF Treon is the Patreon. Um, and uh, subbing to the channel is also appreciated as well. Thanks to those of you who did that tonight. Um, otherwise, publishing stuff, exclamation point Icarus for my graphic novel from Mathis Hearts. Exclamation point Library is my Tales and Tomes from the Forbidden Library. That's my 5e adventure and source book from Alligator Alley Entertainment. And exclamation point um, uh, Grayshade, which is my Grayshade IP, Grayshade, Renegade, and Heretic, the books of the Grey Assassin trilogy. Those are available right now. You can also pre or you can also get the audiobook of Grayshade, um, which will be uh, which is available there from our very own Trent Sparks. You can also pre order the tabletop role playing game of Grayshade, um, which is coming from Alligator Alley and designed by Brandon O'Brien. So that's going to be cool too. So thank you for uh, checking those things out. Otherwise, as always, exclamation point BLM, Black Lives Matter, important to affirm and assert the significance and importance of Black. Black lives. It's G R A Y S H A D E, Jagtress. It's but thank you for trying. It's G R A Y. Um, and uh, so let me see. What else was I saying? Um, yeah, it's the Canadian. It's the Canadian spelling. Yep, 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 yep. Um, so exclamation by BLM, Black Lives Matter, important to affirm and assert the significance and importance of black lives. Exclamation point help now, this is the World Health Organization page on suicide prevention. Important to reach out to others when you need help and reach out to others when they need help as well. And exclamation point Ukraine, U-K-R-A-I-N-E, to help the people of Ukraine as they fight back against an illegal and illegitimate war with bravery and courage and send the message we'll do so for others in this situation in the future. Thank you to my wonderful mods, Dragon Spear, Shadow Mage, Trifity Mats, the best in the business. Thank you to my Patreon supporters and subscribers, Dragon, Shadowed, Triffid, Tilted Gaming, Mrs. Dunsel, and thank you so much to my wonderful viewers. Thank you to Adam, thank you to uh, Ericus, thank you to Betrayer, Gaia Shield, Imaginary Exponent, Jagtress, of course, Jasper Kazai, and Nonstop, and thank you so much to Kids Are Asleep for the raid today as well. Uh, that's it for me. I will see you folks on Saturday for more of this very chill, cool game. Uh, and uh, yeah, again, hope you enjoyed the UK trip, uh, pictures and vids, and I will see you folks Saturday night. Uh, no raid tonight. It's super late. I'm heading to bed. You folks should as well. Uh, thanks, everybody, and I will catch you folks soon. Until then, everyone, please be good to each other, and have a good night. Honk.